Hello, I'm Eric Brill, and I make independent iOS games. This week I sent a new game to Apple called Can You Solve This? So let's take a look at it. At the beginning here, the game generates a rule. There are hundreds of rules it chooses from. Alright, now it generates three random numbers that follow the rule that was just created. There are thousands of different number combinations that can be generated based off of the rule. On this calculator looking screen, we can propose three numbers to get more information about the rule. Since it looks like the previous number is multiplied by two each time, I'm going to propose the numbers 16, 32, and 64. Now it checks and tells me whether it follows the rule or not. It follows the rule. All right, now we get two options. We can guess what the rule is, or we can propose three new numbers. The game is pretty challenging, so unless you're absolutely confident, you generally don't want to blindly move on. The reason being is that there are still several possibilities out there of what the rule could be. We want to propose three new numbers. Everything has been even numbers and everything has followed the multiply 2 rule. Let's try something different. 1, 2, and 3. That ruled a number of options out. Let's see if we can try to not follow the rule. I'm going to count down 7, 8, 9, whoop, whoops, I mean 9, 8, 7. Part of the trick of the game is that you want to get something that doesn't follow the rule. Okay, that doesn't follow the rule. And since we've guessed three times, we're forced to make a decision. Okay, so we've ruled out the multiply previous number by 2 because of our 1, 2, 3 guess. Um, we've also ruled out all numbers are even because of the 1, 2, 3 guess. It couldn't be any whole numbers because of our last guess wasn't correct, so it has to be numbers are ascending. I think the game stays fresh for a while, given the hundreds of rules and thousands of different number sequences. You'll be extremely challenged, even I'm challenged to get a few points in a row, but I don't expect it to be something that entertains you for weeks. It's definitely worth a number of plays and it's free. So yeah, check it out and thanks for watching.